Right, guys, so if you're Cle Clever Spa, another um, error code that you're getting, uh, or well, it's not an error code, it's an actual um, electrical fault, is when your uh, Clever Spa is tripping as soon as you're pressing the heater. So as soon as you're pressing the heater on the heat function on your Clever Spa and, and, it's, and it's clicking off your circuit breaker, So as soon as your circuit breaker is clicking off when you're pressing the heater function, so what you need to do is take your heater element out and replace that because your heater element is split. As you can see, that it's split. So what it's doing is, is exposing the, elect the electrical wires inside of this element to the water of the so you've got this in this chamber. As soon as you, you so it's opening the switch to, to run the electrical current through your heater element and it's in contact with the water as soon as it senses that that's what your circuit breaker is doing its job as soon as it sees it it's a short circuit it's pinging off again right, so you just need to replace this heating element all right so i've got them in stock on the website lazyrepair.co.uk i'll put a link down below to the part it's quite easy so it's easy to follow to replace that part so four screws off your top cover, take that off. Then you take two or three screws off this top cover here, unscrew the screws on this flange, unplug your jumpers, and just replace that. All right, guys. Laser repair to the UK. Get this part on the uh, on my website with warranty as well. It's always good, good practice while you've got this open as well. Just check your temperature sensor and the condition of that. You can see in there, that's your temperature sensor. This one's fine. If that's quite corroded, it's probably water getting ingressed into there as well. And that would flag up an error, an HO error code at some point. All right. So um, that's why it's tripping. Quick rundown on your HO error code while I'm here, while I've got you here. Right, so if you're getting an HO error code, as soon as you're switching the unit on, as soon as you power on and you're getting it's beeping HO, 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 right, that's because your temperature sensor is getting gross water. Right, so that's a similar thing. So the, the, the water's the water's short circuit in your, your sense, the water's your, your sense temperature probe, right? So that, that needs changing. Again, I've got that on the website, laserrepair.co.uk. You can grab that part on there as well. Easy to easy to change. Just um, undo the two screws, scrape all this adhesive off, drill out the hole, um, and put another probe in, and just plug it into your circuit board in there. All right. That's if you get a HL error code as soon as you're switching on your clever spar. All right. If you're getting a HL error code after it's heated, so once it runs up to temperature, so if it goes up, you know. Creep it up to your temperature and it gets up to 45 and then boom you get an HO error code. Alright. That is not your temperature sensor because your temperature sensor is working because it's going up in temperature. Alright, and the heat is working. Then what you need to do with that, there's, there's a um a relay on your board that is not functioning. So just replace the whole circuit board. Again, I've got them on the website. So your board's inside here, you undo these four screws, untake this flap off, your board will come out. Um, and just replace like for like, all right? That will cure your HL error code, which is a higher temperature fault. You've, you've main, you, so you've got, eventually you've got two HL error codes. You've got your higher temperature error code, and you've got your HL error code where it's not sensing no temperature whatsoever because the probe's ingress water and it's uh, short circuiting. All right, so that's your Clever Spa faults easily diagnosed if you're getting no power at all to your unit two things to check your socket make sure you've got power coming in and you can check that by pop by how do you check your power yeah if you're getting power through your socket right so if you're pressing the reset and test and it's not clicking then you could either get no power to this so your socket try another socket make sure you're getting power if you're still not clicking then this needs replacing all right if this is clicking and still getting no power to your hot tub whatsoever, then just replace your transformer. All right, that's that. Easy to do. I've got these on the website as well, laserrepair.co.uk. Um, 
there is one more HL error code that I didn't what, what could could happen is if you've got no water flowing and your impeller's broke inside your pump what could happen is the water in the chamber is just sitting there not flowing and it and it could overheat inside there all right you know because you've got to get a really loud noise in there like that what that impeller's smashing around inside all right guys so yeah um if you if you're not if you're not confident doing this work then uh you can you can get a collection for your units 14.99 buy it on the website do it for this unit will get collected comes to me i'll fix it for you and then send it back give us a thumbs up guys and uh, subscribe thank you cheers bye